as a round. You can do more if you want to. If you haven't done, find your tabletop hands and knees. And do the same thing. Inhale, lift your chest up, look up, pose for a moment, keeping your front side of the neck nice and long. Good. As you exhale, round your back, look at your belly, hollow it out, spread your two shoulder blades apart. With a slow motion, inhale, hips up. Exhale, slow down, round your back, pose. Inhale, drop your belly, chest forward or up. Exhale, let it go. Two more like this. Favorite to pose, take a pose in the position that feels good for your body. On next inhale, find a neutral spine, bring your knees together. Extend your right leg back. Inhale. Bring your right knee carefully, knee to the chest, round your back. Inhale, press into your palms, lift your chest up. Exhale, round your back again, engage your core a little bit more. Inhale, extend. Exhale. Two more. Now take your right knee back and up, pose for a moment if you wish. Release your left hand, reach your hand to your foot and lift your right knee a bit higher. You might look forward if you can make a balance, look back over your left shoulder. If not, just stay here, it's for another day. <laughs> be playful, be kind to your body. Two more breaths. Nice and young, you can lift your right knee a bit higher if your body allows. One, that's enough, release, left hand down, right knee down, switch your side, left leg back, breathing, knee to chest, exhale, give me four more, breathing, lengthen, open, expand, exhale, round, engage, connect your core strength. Find your own pace. I'm gonna take one more. Good, once you're done, take your left foot back, left knee bend, hold, or reach your right hand to your left foot, lift. Okay. You might pick over your right shoulder if it feels okay for your neck. Stay for three. Lay more center in your body, two. Balance it out, one. If you haven't done, release. Take your knees apart, feet together for extended child pose. Draw your hips down toward your heels, relax your head down on your mat. Notice and observe. Observe what happens in your body now. Take one more breath here. Next inhale lifts you up. Find the first sound of this practice. Feet about your hip this apart, lift your hip side, spread your 10 fingers nice and wide. 
Press into the knuckle of your hands, feel the foundation, find your roots in your hands and feet. Your heels can be up or down on your mat. First down dog, you might move, explore yourself on your own. Any shapes, any movement, any wiggles. Feel free to find your expression. And don't forget to breathe. One more deep inhale. Long deep exhale. Knees bend, feet to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Take your time. Exhale, fold and relax. Two more. Breathe in, lengthen through your spine. Exhale, chest toward your thighs best you can. Breathe in. Let something go. Breathe out. Rise up to stand. Inhale, extend your arms up. Take your left hand down for a side stretch, right hand up and over, and pose here. You might look toward your right fingertips. Stay for two. One. Inhale, comes up, exhale. Take your right hand down, this time left hand lengthen open through your left side. You might take your right fingers a little bit down toward your right side of knee. One more breath. Next inhale lifts you up. Bend your elbows, cactus your arms. Open up the chest. Inhale, reach up high. Exhale, bend. Breathe in. Breathe out. Now take your hands on your side of your waist or hips. Right foot steps back for a pyramid shape. Inhale, lift your chest up. As you exhale, hinge from your hips for pyramid pose. You can take your hands on your leg or on your mats. Good. Stay for five breaths. One, nice long spine. Two. Three, four, five. Hands on your hips, slowly come up. Good. Stepping your right foot forward, switch side. Inhale, spine nice and low. You might look up, hug your shoulder blades to each other if you haven't done. As you exhale, hinge at your hips, fold over your leg. You might stay here or take your hands down wherever they fall. Five breath. Activate both legs. Engage your core muscle, draw your belly toward your spine. Three, nice and long. Four, lengthen through your spine, your neck as well. Draw your shoulders back away from your ears. Again, hands on your hips. If you haven't done, slowly come up. Good. Both feet together at the top of the space. Bend your knees to your pose. Inhale. As you exhale, fold over your thighs, hinge from your hips again. Bend your knees to your pose. Inhale, Utkatasana, hips back. Exhale, stretch your legs, relax your head and neck. Give me three more. Inhale, back to chair. Exhale. Breathe in strong thighs, your core. Exhale, let it go. Inhale, knees bend, hips a little bit lower. 
exhale down we'll meet in a chair bend your knees inhale extend your arms up okay take your right knee bend toward your chest right foot up off the mat find some balance here stay for three two hip one inch lower if possible one right knee one inch higher if it sounds not that crazy Good. take your right foot back pyramid the shape again inhale both legs nice and low you might look up keep the arms nice and low good as you exhale hinge it from your hips from here we are gonna take the twist right hand down left hand up to the sky yes keeping both legs nice and low lots of stretch for your hamstring today stay for three and you keep the left hand over your shoulder two one listen to your body take good care of yourself now you can take your left hand down bend your left knee take your time walk your hands forward see if you can lift your right leg up for a standing split I know it's a little bit early in the beginning of the class. You might take your right foot, just extend it up. Doesn't need to be super high. Inhale here. Right knee to the chest. Exhale. Good. Inhale, stretch out and up. Exhale. Only three more. Breathe in. Breathe out. Inhale, expand your body. Exhale, reconnect your core two one good take your right foot down next your left foot <clears throat> excuse me bend your knees chair pose inhale extend your arms up good exhale fold over your thighs again bend your knees chair inhale lengthen through your spine exhale fold three breathe in breathe out a little more strength in your legs and hips two find your own pace one be yourself truly be with your body get back to chair inhale good this side weight on your right foot pick up your left foot up one leg chair good. stay for three Hips a little bit lower if you can. Two, keep the left knee bent, lift lift. You might feel the difference then. Strength in both sides of hips. One more. Inhale here, you got it. As you exhale, take your left foot back, pyramid pose. Inhale, lift your chest up, a little bit of back bend if it sounds okay. As you exhale, fall over your thigh. Take it to the twist, left hand down, right hand reaches up. Good. Hand can be anywhere, but if you extend your right arm up, keep the right hand over your shoulder and open up the chest as much as you can. Stay for three. Two. Keep the belly engaged to twist a bit deeper. One. And you might look down, take both hands down, walk it out to the top of your mat. Pick up your left leg up. Inhale, try again. As you exhale, knee to chest. Inhale, stretch out. Exhale. You got this. Do what you can. Truly, honestly, be yourself. Doesn't need to be the same that I do. Give me one more big breath. You can take one more extra. Good. In your time, left foot down on your mat. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold over your thighs. Bend your knees, chair pose. Keep the legs bent extend your arms up you might take both hands together 
and look up through your thumbs. Yes, find some length, find some strength, sense of kindness, and sense of challenge, whatever comes up now. Stay for two, keep the knees bent best you can. Hips back and down, one, Slowly rain it down, relax your head and neck, hands down. Inhale, flat back. As you exhale, step through your vinyasa plank, shoulders over your wrist, shifting forward. Exhale, bend your elbows, chaturanga or knee, chest, chin. Rolling through your shoulders down, inhale, cobra pose. Good, exhale, take your hips back and offer down dog pose. Take your time, you can take a child pose a little bit longer or you can stay in your down dog to feel the expansion of your body. Stay wherever you are meant to be. One more ujjayi breath, big curious breath through the back of throats. Nice ocean sounds. Good, in your time, find a down dog. Stay or jump to the top of your mat. Inhale, lengthen through your spine. Exhale, you might hold your ankles, back of ankles, chest, work your thighs. Hang out here for three, two, no need to force anything. One, you can gently bend your knees, slowly come up to your stand. Nice. Lots of core strength and a little bit of a stretch our hamstring today. Now we're gonna do some no jumping cardio exercise here. Feel a little bit wider than your hips. Turn your body to the one side. For me, this is my right side. Good. Now I can bend my left knee, pick up my left knee toward the chest. You're gonna extend your arms up, hook your thumbs if you want. Inhale, both hands together. Exhale, hands to your knee. Good. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to chest, hand to. Knee, little tap, one, two, three, four. If you can chest a little bit down, hinge from your hips, but step spine nice and long still. Give me 10, one, a little bit faster, two, three, find some balance, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, great job. Inhale back to center, extend your arms up, starfish pose. Exhale, bend your elbows, cactus your arms. Interlace your fingers behind you. Breathe in, open up the chest. Breathe out again, relax your head and neck, hinge from your hips. Stay for a moment. Nice observation, what's going on in your body. Each exhale, let go of whatever no longer serves you today. One more big inhale. You can take your hands a little bit down toward your mat, exhale. And release your hands, roll yourself up. And we're gonna switch side. Turn your body to the opposite side that you haven't done. Inhale, both hands together. As you exhale, take the bend knee toward your chest, hand tap, knee tap, good. Inhale, exhale. You can do faster or slower. Chest forward, hinge from your hips, take your chest a little bit down. Very good. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, keep the core tight, 4, 3, Two and one, nice job. Back to center, inhale. As you exhale, bend your elbows, open up the chest. 
Inhalate your fingers, opposite thumb on top. Breathe in. Fold over your thighs or between your inner thighs. You might move side to side. Good, letting go of any tension, any stress, any agendas, any things to do. Melt them away. One more breath. Slowly release. Roll yourself up. Good. This time, take your heels in toes out for a wide squat position. Mm. Little bounce, little purse up and down. Keep the spine nice and long. Chest open. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Take your hands up. Inhale. As you exhale, turn your body maybe to the right side first. Little lunge position. Inhale. As you exhale, left knee to your hands. Again, knee tap. Good. Inhale, back to squat. Center. Good. To the left, exhale, right knee tap. Inhale, center, wide squat. Exhale. You got this. You can do it slow or a little speed up. Cardio movement from lunge. Knee tap to wide squat. From wide squat, rotate to the lunge. Good. If you can chest a little bit down and come up, chest down and spine tall. Good. Lots of control. Lots of breath. <laughs> it's okay. You can fall out, come back. Again, being playful in your practice. Slowly deep in your hips, dip down, dip down. Give me five. I know you can do it. Four. Three. You can scrub any time too. No one is perfect. One, I don't know how many times I repeat this one before this practice. Okay, whenever you're ready, back to center. Extend your arms out for V shape. Inhale. As you exhale, bend your elbows, hips down. Stay a little bit longer for three. Keep the chest open. Two, take your elbows a little bit backward. One, feel something in your hips and legs. Good. As you exhale, heels out, toes in, fold over your legs. You can stay here or walk your hands to your right foot. Right toes slightly out. Inhale. Exhale, chest over your thigh. Feel free to hold your ankle or just keep the hands where they are. Slow down your breath. One more breath, inhale, let something go. Back to your center, switch side. Inhale, hug your belly in, chest toward your leg. Stay for three. As long as you feel something in your body, you're doing good, something positive. One more. Nice long exhale. Get back to center. Walk your hands to the top of your mat. Make your way to plank position. Take one vinyasa before we taking a little bit of fun. <laughs> Various uh, variety of plank today. Inhale, chest forward. Exhale, chaturanga, chest down. Relax your shoulders, inhale for Cobra. Down downward child pose, exhale. Two more, inhale. Two more, long exhales. Be kind, be gentler, 
be honest to your body because this time is only for yourself. Good. First plank of today is knees down, tabletop uh, plank variation. From here, you're going to extend your right arm forward, but make sure your two shoulders in level, hips in level. So it's your right hand down underneath your right shoulder, left hand reaches forward, just like this. Left hand down, right arm forward. Right hand down, left hand forward. Good. Give me three more. One, reach it forward, spine nice and long. Hug your belly in all the time. Keep the arm nice and long. Keep the back nice and straight. Yeah, last one. Think about longer body. Good. Now, take your elbows down for elbow plank position. Extend your legs. Bring your feet together if you wish. Take your right leg up. Only right leg up. <laughs> because we cannot lift both. Left leg up. <laughs> Switch. Alternate your legs up and down. Squeeze your hips. Good. Activate your core. Good. Give me three more. One. Two. Chest a little bit forward. Shoulders stick over your elbows. When you're done, knees down, back to tabletop again. Again, hand reach forward in a plank position. So extend your legs. Same thing. Feet about your hip is apart or even wider. Totally cool. Extend your right arm forward. Take it down, left hand forward. Switch. Think about longer back, longer spine. Your hand is no lower than your shoulder. Try your best. Lift your hand up. Give me five. Listen to your body. Oh, if it doesn't feel good, doesn't serve you today, keep the knees down, do the same thing. Three. No right and wrong in your practice. Two. One more. Once you're done, drop your knees down. Again, take your elbows down under your shoulders. This time, extend your legs back for a side tap. Feet together. Take your right foot out. Right foot in. Take your left foot out, left foot in, good. Right foot out and in, left foot out and in. Strong core and arms. Activate your whole body. Keep the chest away from your mat. I think I'm tired too. <laughs> Give me three more. One and two. Belly in, three, back to center, knees down, tabletop, hands down underneath your shoulders. Not yet, not child pose yet. <laughs> Inhale, lift your chest up for cow pose. As you exhale, lift your hips up for down dog pose. Good. Inhale to plank. From here, take your right knee to the chest. Good. Right foot back, down dog. Again, back to plank, directly left knee to the chest. Good, inhale, hips up. Exhale, right knee to the chest in your plank. Go ahead, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Knee to chest. Nice and slow. Well, if you want to, you can speed up. Control yourself. Challenge yourself. At the same time, listen to yourself. Give me three more. Each side. Mm -hmm. 
Nice and young. Your own shape. One. Good. Last plank today. Elbows down. Hopefully, elbows underneath your shoulders. Extend your legs for a hip tip. Take your feet all the way to the right side. Both feet out of your mat. And right hip down. Twist. Deep your hip. Opposite side. Opposite side. Yes. Okay. Back to center. Feet to the left. Out of your mat. Twist. Left hip down. Back to center. To the right. Get down. Good. Step out and down. Step out. Deepen your hips. Keep going. If it doesn't feel good in your lower back, totally fine. You can just stay in your elbow plank for 30 seconds. I'm gonna join you after 30 seconds. So either way is good. Stay in your elbow plank or keep going. Take your feet to the side for hip dips. A little more fire. A little more challenge. And a little more patience. Get one more. And we will meet at the center of your mat. Hold for 10 seconds in your elbow plank. Hips no higher than your elbows. I mean your shoulders. <laughs> Three, two, belly in. One, and you're down. Knees down, chest down, hips high. Relax your body. You can take a child pose. Or like I'm doing, puppy stretch to open up your shoulders. Two more cleansing breath. Good news, you're gonna lay down on your back. I guess we need a little break. Relax your head, back of the head down. Let your head really heavy. Now you can take both the shoulders away from your ears to soften your neck. Feel free to bend your knees. Stack your knees over your ankle for a bridge shape. Once you're ready, hands by your hips, palms down. Exhale, lift your hips up. Hug your belly in, tuck your tailbone toward your knees. Again, hips down. Exhale to lift your hips up toward your knees. Up and down, inhale, exhale, squeeze and lift. Take seven. Five. Three. And one. Stay at the top. Lift your hips up. Engage your core and your glutes. Give me three deep breaths. One. Two, three, release your hips down, good, extend both legs up, shake your legs and shake your hands, yes, any wiggles, you can rotate your ankles and your wrists at the same time, same directions, and the other way. Now you can take your hands under your head to support your neck, extend your legs out for V shape. 
feel the stretch in your inner thighs. We're gonna make some circles. Take your feet down, but not touch. Hover your heels up off the mat, feet together. Inhale, lift your feet up. As you exhale, open your legs out and bring your feet together. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower. Inhale. Exhale. Keep the core muscle engaged. Inhale. Take your leg as wide as you can. In. Out. Okay, give me five circles. Nice stretch for your thighs. A little bit of strength in your lower belly. Three. Keep the legs nice and straight. Two. One. Good. Inhale, lift your feet up. Good. Now you can take your hands toward your feet. You can touch your finger, hands to your feet, or maybe your ankle or shins. Good. Inhale down. Exhale, lift. Inhale down. Exhale, lift. Good. In. Out. Activate your core. Good. Only two more. Now we're going to alternate our leg. Take your right foot down. Let your right heel up off the mat. Hands toward your left foot. Good. And switch. Right leg up. Touch. Right leg down. Hand to your left. Keep going. If you can, keep the chest lifted. Just alternate your leg, scissors action. If you need to, you can take your head down and lift. <laughs> A little more core strength here. Five, but don't force yourself. Four, do what you can for yourself. Three, two, your pace. One, once you're done, release. Hug your knees into the chest. Good, eagle pose here. Left foot down, right knee stack over your left knee, cross your knees, good. Eagle arms, extend your arms up. Take your left elbow on top of your right, cross your elbows. Left arm on top, like X shape. Yeah. You can hug your shoulder blades or you hug your shoulders wherever they land, or you can bind your arms one or twice, palms together or top of hands together, like this. Yes. If it doesn't feel good, just take your hands around your shoulders. Take your left foot up, inhale, exhale, elbow to knee. Crunch. Good. Inhale down, exhale, lift. Don't stay long on your mat. Inhale, exhale, lift. Good. Seven, six, five, four, three. Little tap on your left foot, your toes. Two, one. Hold at the top. Elbow to knee. Stay for three. And two, one. And release. You <laughs> extend your arms, hallelujah. <laughs> okay, take your right foot down, switch. Left knee on top. Good, eagle legs, eagle arms, right arm on top. You can bind one or twice, or hands over your shoulders. Give me 10, crunch. Inhale, exhale, lift. One, two, three, four, Five, six, any shape. Just do what feels right. Three more. Two, one. Lift your chest, knee toward your elbow. Stay for three. Two, feel something in your belly. One, I feel something already. <laughs> Exit, release. Under your arms and legs. Take your knees out, feet together. Rest for a moment. You can take your hands over your head if it feels better. Mm -hmm. 
nice cleansing breath. Feel free to stay here as much as needed. Next up, take your body to the right side, roll on your right hip. Good. Press into your left hand, slowly come up for your seated. Yes, good. Check in with your neck and shoulders. You can move around your neck. We tend to hold some tension through our course the exercise. So maybe it's good for you to move. Release, let go. Back to neutral spine, inhale, extend your arms up. Gentle twist over to your right side. Inhale, back up, extend your arms up. Exhale, twist the left. Inhale, center, bend your elbows, open up the chest. Good. Inhale, extend your arms up. As you exhale, take your hips up, make your own way to tabletop, hands and knees. Good. Inhale, tuck your toes under. Exhale, lift your hips side for down dog. Feet together, little flow. Inhale, extend your right leg up, dog split. As you exhale, right knee into the chest. Listen, take your right foot to the left side for a side plank variation. Mm -hmm. So thread your right leg under your left. Watch me. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Left hand up. Inhale. Good. Option one, you stay here. Option two, make an eagle arm, leg, excuse me, eagle leg. Take your right knee. Over your left knee, cross your knee. If it does <laughs> sound really <laughs> make sense for you, you can just stay in your side flank. Stay for three. Even you can do fallen triangle, lift your chest up. Two, yes. One, hips a little bit higher. Take your left hand down, right leg up, inhale. Good. As you exhale, take your right knee to the right wrist for pigeon pose. Mm -hmm. Little break here. Walk your hands out in front of you, or you can take your full head down over your hands. Pause for a moment. Stay for three, two, one. Inhale, chest up if you have not done. Bend your left knee, hold your foot with your right hand, pulling your heel toward your hip. Again, if you cannot hold, no big deal. You can reach someday, so it will be coming to you. So be patient. Stay for three. Yes, patience is everything in your practice, I guess in your life too. One more breath. Release your right hand down in front of you. Make your way to downward facing dog. Take one vinyasa. Inhale to plank. Exhale, chaturanga, chest down. Open up your chest in cobra. Down dog, exhale, hips high. Join your feet together, big toes touch. Left leg up high, inhale. Left knee into the chest, really hollow it up. Knee toward your chest. Now you can take your left foot all the way to the right side. Side plank variation, right hand up. Totally cool to stay. Another option, bind your knee, your left knee on top. You're taking your left foot, the top of foot behind your right shin or wrap around. Good, stay for three, two, Reach up high, one. You might look up, inhale. As you exhale, take your right hand down under your left leg, breathing left leg up. Yes, yes. As you exhale, take your left knee to the left hand for pigeon pose. Breathe in, chest up. 
Breathe out, chest down. Nice breath here. Nice observation to your body. For yourself. Honestly, carefully, mindfully observe your body without any judgments. Feel free to stay here or take your chest out. Get a little twist toward your left side. You can take your left hand on your right thigh or behind your back. Maybe, maybe now you can find your foot and pulling your right heel toward your hip. Good. Good. Yes, stay there. Two. One. In your time, slowly release. Good. Make your way to downward facing dog. You're gonna skip the vinyasa from here. Just bend your knees, open your knees a little bit wider, like a frog shape. You can jump or step out to the top of your mat, but your feet are a little bit wider than your hands for lower squat. Good, Asian squat or malasana in yoga. Fingertips down, lift up high on your fingertips. Inhale, exhale, stretch your legs, good. Bend your knees, hips lower. Inhale, exhale, stretch out. Inhale, powerful exhale. In, out. Give me six, five. You can do it slow, four, three. Strong legs. Stretch up, two, one. Pose in your squat. Again, listen to your body. Find your own way to open up your inner thighs. Hands prayer or keep the hands down. Spine nice and long, you might look forward. Good. Stay for three, two, relax your neck please. One, press in your feet, slowly reach up high. Inhale like a rocket. Breathe in, reach your hands up. Exhale, little back bend, hands back. Inhale here, stay lower. Exhale, stay longer, I should say. Give me two more breaths. Feel the nice stretch in your belly, your shoulders, maybe somewhere else. Slowly take your hands together in front of your heart. Good. Heel toe, heel toe. Bring your feet together. Back to where we started. Chair pose. Bend your knees. Utkatasana. Extend your arms up. Stay here and lift your right heel up. Maybe you can stay here if it is already plenty. Or take your right knee on top of your left. Eagle legs. You can tiptoes on your right or you can let it hover. Yes, let your right foot hover if you can. Maybe you can bind arms as well. Extend your arms forward. Eagle arms, left arm on top. X shape and then hug your shoulder blades. Or you can bind your arms. Standing eagle pose. Totally fine. You can jump. <laughs> and you can take your elbow toward your knee. We are going to stay for three breaths. You can stay still in a static pose or you can lift your elbow up and down to crunches. Inhale, exhale, nice. Control, one more. Breathing, breathe out. Okay, if you want to stay more, feel free to do so. In your time, slowly release. Good, extend your arms up, breathe in. Let it go, exhale, bend your elbows, open up the chest. Inhale, reach up high, rain it down, exhale. 
Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold. Rise up to stand. Breathe in. Hands together. Exhale. All put aside. Are you ready? <laughs> We're gonna take our left knee this time. Left foot up off the mat. Here, or bind, cross, good. You might stay here or tiptoes on your left. Extend your arms forward. Right arm on top of your left. Connect your arms together. Whatever it looks like. You might something, you might feel something in your arms, shoulders, and your core as well. Okay, slowly hinge it from your hips if it sounds makes sense to you. Good. Keeping your core super tight, elbow to knee if possible. You might stay here or lift your elbow up. Exhale, take it down. Inhale. Exhale, one more. You might hang out more in your time release under your legs and arms, directly interlace your fingers behind you. Inhale, lift your chest up, stay for three, two. You might lift your chin up, head back. One, bend your knees generously, fold over your thighs. One breath here. Take your hands down, make your way to plank position. Shoulders over your wrist, inhale. As you exhale, chaturanga lower. One cobra, inhale. One upper push up, chest down, press up to plank. Two more, chest forward, inhale. Exhale, chaturanga dansasana. Cobra, inhale. Strong core and arms, push up to plank. One more, breathe in, chest forward, shoulders away. Exhale, lengthen through your neck. Open up the chest. Push up to downward facing dog. Great job, held up. Lion breath here, inhale, lift your hips up. As you exhale, stick your tongue out, let it go. Good, inhale, through your mouth, exhale, and your breath out. One more, breathe in, let everything go. Good. Bend your knees, look forward. Stabler hop to the top of your mat. Inhale, heavy lift. Exhale, fold. Rise up, breathe in. Hands together, breathe out. Pause for a moment. Observe and listen. Reconnect yourself, whatever that means to you. You might let go of what did happen through your practice today. You might choose to let go of what didn't happen to you in your practice. Sense of accept, accept, as who you are, as how you are. And embrace whatever comes up for yourself today. It can be one of your intentions for the rest of your day. Take last breath here. If you haven't done, open up your eyes. Inhale, look up, extend your arms up. As you exhale, swan diving. Inhale, heavy lift. 
as you exhale fold bend your knees to your pose inhale transition to navasana both pose hips down you can use your hands if you want to and lift your feet up extend your arms up breathe in keep the knees bent and twist right hand forward left hand back inhale back up left hand forward twist over to the right just like this inhale reach up exhale twist nice and slow you're right in your inhale just spine nice and long exhale twist as deep as you can breathe in don't drop your heels down yet exhale twist inhale reach up high you might stay or hold your thighs you might stay with a bent knee or extending your legs best you can take five four three hug your knees toward your chest two one release your heels take your hands behind you press and lift open up the chest you can take your head back if it feels okay for your neck say for five four three feel free to move two lift your chest once more release your heel hips down tuck your chin in toward your chest carefully land down on your mat good find your own way to chill and relax yourself in your shavasana you can take any movements any wiggles any adjustment before you truly settle in If you notice any tension in your neck or in your face, feel free to soften your facial muscles, making little beautiful smile in your face. Any self-expression, not for anyone else, for your body, for your inner peace. Noticing your breath become slow. Your body becomes heavier. You can take the shavasana as long as as much as your body allows or your time allows today joining both palms together in front of your heart thank yourself for taking some time for yourself and you can think about someone else who you want to thank, 
who you want to express your gratitude. Thumbs to your third eye between your eyebrows to have a clear and loving thoughts. Hands to your lips to have a clear and loving communication to yourself and with the others too. Hands back to your heart to have a clear and loving intention for yourself, for your day. Take care. Namaste.